Hello, my dear NEET warriors who have attempted the paper in this particular year 2024. There is a very important update and uh, this is of official update, not from NTA, but from the news reports. And this is a official petition which has been filed in the high court. So let's straight away dive into the article. And before we dive into the article, because most of these articles are also in Hindi, I'm going to translate it for you. Make sure that you are smashing the like button because this is the only channel helping you in particularly English for all the need aspirants. Make sure that you like and subscribe to the channel so that you do not miss any proper updates or basically official updates because we don't spread rumors. We will only give you information when it is correct. Okay. So thank you for liking and thank you for subscribing. See these articles over here, these articles over here, they talk about, you know, uh, the paper leak situation which happened in NEET 2024 and this has reached the Patna High Court in Bihar and it calls for the complete examination, cancellation and CBI investigation. Now the moment CBI is involved, it means it is very serious stuff. It is not a joke. Till police level, FIR is being registered. That is a different story. At the moment CBI, CBI is a national level organization. That means it's a serious level stuff. I will read you the news article as well here and here also you will see the same news articles. Just let me go through the uh, one over here. Need exam paper leak pariksha ke prashna patra leak mamle mein ab tak tera logo ki giraftari hui hai. Patna high court mein is mamle ko lekar lokahit yachika dayar ki gai hai. Is mein prashna patra leak mamle ki jaj CBI se karne ka anurod kiya gaya hai. Yachika mein pariksha ko rad kar uh, rad karne sire se something karne ki bhi baat ki gai okay so the main idea the main uh, you know uh, the main uh, gist of the matter is that somebody has filed a proper case in the Patna High Court and they want the exam to be cancelled because the paper was leaked and there were dummy candidates. In fact, there is a proper English uh, news article also over here. The alleged paper leak scandal involving the NEET examination has now reached the uh, High Court as a public interest litigation. PIL has been filed and the uh, in this connection demanding the complete cancellation of the examination. According to the report, by law trend, law trend is basically uh, telling you, you know, whatever articles or whatever, you know, PILs or whatever cases are being registered in the high court. So it is going to give you the information on that. The plea has also called for an investigation why that paper leak scam has happened. And for that paper leak scam to be investigated, CBI has to be involved. This development comes at a time when the need aspirants have been demanding reconduction of the exam citing the reports of paper leak in the uh, entrance test and around 13 people including four examinees and their family members were arrested in Bihar for their involvement in paper leak for the NEET 2024 exam. Also the answers were provided to 20 aspirants one day before NEET exam was on 5th May, 4th May only the People, 20 people got the paper before only and uh, the Bihar police took over the investigation revealed that the brokers involved took between 30 lakh rupees to 50 lakh rupees from each medical aspirant. That means they are definitely not poor people. They are definitely well to do. Just because you have money, you pay 30, 50 lakhs and you get a good need score. So that is what has happened. Okay. And the question paper was given to them. Obviously, they would have asked their teachers and got the, all the answers before only. EOU had earlier mentioned that as per the investigation, the paper and their answers were provided to around 35 aspirants before the May 5th examination. Vishal Saurav is the person who has filed the PIL, right? On behalf of advocate Sujit Kumar Sinha in the High Court of Patna, okay? And CBI should uh, investigate the matter. That is what the demand is. The plea claimed that the future of millions of students were at stake because of the alleged paper leak scandal. FIR had also been registered at Shastri Nagar police station where 13 suspects were detained 
because they had obtained the scanned copy of the paper leak and it was sent to a young man's mobile in Danapur. Further, Purnia, Hajipur, police also arrested four and one fake candidates for attempting to appear the test on somebody else's behalf. Medical dialogues had also reported that 14 impersonators had already been, uh, you know, arrested uh, who were impersonating other people, right? These were 14 people who were already been arrested. The accused were known as paper solvers. So instead of the actual person, these paper solvers will write the exam on your behalf and they were charging 5 to 10 lakh rupees. So guys, the rates are fixed. It's simple. You want somebody else to write the paper for you, you pay 5 to 10 lakh rupees. If you want the paper one day before, you pay 30 to 50 lakh rupees. So these are the rates going on in the market, okay? If you want a medical seat, then you are not able to afford here. No problem. You got very low marks in it. Then you pay 30 lakhs, 50 lakhs, 1 crore, and then you get a medical seat in the private colleges. Everything is, you know, uh, fixed rate wise. So if you have money, very good. If you don't have money, then you take a drop. If you don't have uh, the enough score, take a drop again. So that trend is happening. What is happening guys? I mean, really? This is, this is, is this even right? What do you guys say? This is disheartening guys. This is horrible. Now, I want to know from you, is the re-exam, I'm not judging anything. I'm just asking all of you. I want you to put it up in the comments. Is re-exam the solution? Or something else is the solution? Because I got many calls from the students and these students are getting 690, 680, 640, 670 marks. Will these students still get the same marks again? Because I know they are very sincere students. What if their year gets wasted? Let's say instead of 670 in the re-exam, they get 600. By chance, it can happen. Again, their year got wasted, again re-exam. Next year, they have to take a drop. What if, you know, there are more students involved? Won't it be unfair on other students? These are the students who are arrested. What about many students who will not get caught, but actually they have cheated. What if there is a proper way of conducting the exam? Number three, what about this bonus, borderline bonus kind of questions? Yeah, this is another question which you need to think about. I have a solution to propose. At least for the next year, need 2025, because many of you have already decided to take a drop. You tell me whether it is correct or wrong. Okay, ready to listen to it? I feel that there should be exam two times with a decent gap. It could be one month, two month, whatever. And the best of the two scores should be considered. And I feel that the paper, it better be online only. So there is no question of paper leak because once it is online, it is protected by software, just like it happens in J mains. In J, the paper does not get leaked only. Why? Because it is encrypted, coded into the software and it will be popping out, you know, only at the time of exam. Exam is of three hours. There is no question of less duration because once the timer starts, you have to attempt the paper for three hours. It does not depend only on the invigilator. Even if the paper starts late, the timer will end late. So I feel, you correct me if I'm wrong, next year at least, paper should be online and the exam should be conducted two times. Do you guys agree with me or no? J is the best way, yes, to conduct the exam. The way J NTA conducts, same NTA is doing it for J. Why can't NTA do it for NEET? I know the number of students are more. Okay, fine, you conduct the exam for one week, no problem. Or you have more centers, you can do it more efficiently. And you conduct it two times. Why two times? Because then the best of the scores will come. Many students fall sick or something goes wrong, you're not able to reach. Some or the other problem happens, you have a second chance. At least you don't waste one year. It's better to spend one month and rewrite the exam in the same year than the, rather than spending one more year and then putting all your efforts on that one exam. What do you guys think? If you feel that I am right, share this video. We will request NTA at least for 2025. Your juniors, your batchmates who are taking a drop will not be affected. Don't think about 2024. I mean, whether re-exam happens or not, that's nobody's prediction. Nobody can say that. 
nobody will be able to figure that out until some decision comes i'm just laying down the facts for all of you at least for 2025 shouldn't this happen yes or no if you want i'll make a separate video on that we'll request nta for that okay thank you so much do not forget to like share and subscribe and by the way let me tell you on the official website there is no update yet about the answer key there is no update yet on the answer key we are still waiting for that there were reports saying it will come today yesterday no it has not yet come okay so don't worry about it those of you are planning to take a drop remember we have the dna batch we have the dna batch and the dna batch has just started i have started taking on the big board yes we teach on the big screen not on the small screen the link is there over here even in the description box of this video just click on this link and remember the dna batch is just for 3999 for the entire year with test series assignments big board classroom notes doubt solving in the class all the three subjects in english with a revision test series mock tests and 500 plus books which are given to you as e books which we have tied up with the publishers like tata magrel disha publications and so much more grb also you get the tatva module soft copy assignments dpb generators all at this cost even if you buy a test series it will be more than this this offer is only there till this sunday after sunday the prices go up so make sure you are enrolling in the 2025 droppers batch where entire 11th and 12th standard syllabus will be completed in the next few months make sure you are a part of it make sure you are in that english batch let me tell you this is the only channel in english which cares for you other channels might do it for views but i don't do it for views i do it only and only because what is right and what is important that's it if something is important for you something bothers you something you know is troubling you something is useful for you only then i will come live okay if there are rumors if it's not right i will not make a video on it so if you feel that i am right about this that there should be uh, two exams in online mode just like it is done for j or if there is some better solution that solution also you can put in the comments i might be wrong i am just a human if you have a better solution please put it up for 2025 we'll make a separate video for that and we'll request nta because nta watches our videos let me tell you that yeah nta keeps watching youtube that's why they release the uh, you know uh, notifications if you notice over here based on the post circulating on social media based on whatever things have happened so they keep a track and if one channel does it i'm pretty sure other channels will also copy and they will also do it let them copy it's okay at least every channel will make a video right and that is better for you only so good let them copy let anybody copy our video but if it is good if it is for the benefit of the students i don't mind but we will be the start of the revolution thank you so much captain shreyas signing off assalamu alaikum